Hi, this is Thundee from borderwalk.com and today I'll be showing you how to set up the BlackBerry Bridge uh, so you can check your email uh, with from your BlackBerry device to your playbook. So what you need of course is your BlackBerry and of course you need to have the Bluetooth turned on, you can see there, and of course your playbook. And so first thing is you have the Bluetooth turned on on your BlackBerry and you swipe down, you go into settings and you go to BlackBerry Bridge, have that up. Click Setup. Please enter the name of your playbook. I'm just going to leave it like that. Hit Next. Uh, install BlackBerry uh, Bridge. Install from BlackBerry World app. So install now. If you've already installed, you can continue. I'm just going to install now. Download the BlackBerry Bridge onto your smartphone. Or you can just quickly scan there. And, uh, and you head back. So we're just going to head back and we're going to scan that and then go ahead and set this up. So I have the BlackBerry Bridge uh, software here. Download. Alright, so we have the BlackBerry Bridge uh, software downloaded. Just agree to it. Bridge is on. Add new tablet. So we have the Bluetooth turned on here. Because we'll just bring our playbook back into the picture. I'm just going to zoom out here a little bit to give you guys a better look. There we go. So, hit back here on the playbook. Install now. Add new tablet here on your BlackBerry smartphone. Hit continue. Continue here also. Manual pairing, and of course they should <coughs> look for each other and pair. This is all done by Bluetooth. Just give it some time. Manual pairing. Sorry, hit and continue doesn't do that. But manual pairing, you found it, says one device found. Won't stop, we'll just wait for it. Blackberry playbook. There we go, have that in there. Waiting for playbook. Playbook's founded. Bluetooth device. Pairing attempt, yes here. And check for this number, yes here. Waiting for BlackBerry 9650. Please enter secret code. You see, you can basically see it there. So I'm just going to enter it. Q, of course, and then there, F. Okay. Bridge is installed on smartphone pairing complete on home screen tap BlackBerry Bridge to access your BlackBerry smartphone applications and you are done. So let's jump in here. Let's see where's the BlackBerry Bridge. And um Oh, already. Bridge files, messages. So basically, um, a couple of things uh, jump through here. Uh, contacts have been transferred already from the BlackBerry 9650 to our play playbook. We have our contacts, we have our messages, we have bridge files, we have bridge browser. So I can jump into messages, contact the BlackBerry smartphone, pulls up messages. Of course, that takes a little bit to load. Hmm, crashed. See, or I can jump into messages there. I have a messages icon that brings it up. So actually, basically, I can pull the messages and look at the messages. Sorry, up on the side, yeah, 54. Scroll through, tap out. If I go into bridge files, 
should bring up the bridge files I have. This is the bridge files I have. I do have the calendar. It shows up. My calendar shows up here. So um, this is BlackBerry's secure way of bringing all these files out. You can see there's some crashing. And um, that's just showing you how things are linked. One more thing, we can also show you how to use your Bluetooth to tether uh, internet connectivity. So I'm going to turn the Wi-Fi off here. You see it's off. Go to internet tethering. Connect Bluetooth to show your internet. Select a Bluetooth device. I selected that already. Select a wireless profile. Additional. Use to connect device so the carrier of course that we use so basically you're going to use select the carrier that you use with your blackberry device I'm just going to say Verizon easy and see what we come up with uh, maybe it's here. so Verizon wireless no information is required connect tethering charges uh, continue So authenticating and basically this connects so even so if you have as long as you have a blackberry you can tether with your blackberry if you have your bluetooth to your playbook and it will give you internet connectivity so it's very simple very easy to use and um, if as long as you have your a blackberry you're connected to the internet so you're able to con you're not connected to the internet and i am tethered as you can see internet tethering through my blackberry 9650 which means i have internet connection through this so as long as I have my BlackBerry I can connect a uh, BlackBerry uh, smartphone I connect with my playbook to it to the internet so let's quickly roll through here let's um, see what we have here let's go to Slack radio just press play so it's still playing okay, no connection okay Try that again and uh, see what's going on there. Okay, I guess the internet tethering they're disconnected, so yeah, our tethering kind of disconnected there. But you do get uh, the idea, it's not fully perfect, but it does work. Uh, bridge is still connected, and we're just gonna switch back our Wi Fi on so. There you have it, that is uh, BlackBerry Bridge, as well as the uh, internet tethering with the BlackBerry, your BlackBerry smartphone and your playbook. You can see basically a couple of apps do show up, your messages do show up, you have a message icon on the top, your contacts do show up in your playbook, and then basically these two are paired. So for you to actually set access your email and all your messages, uh, you need to basically link this and link this via Bluetooth and you can access all your uh, messages. So anyway, if you guys have any questions, any comments, let us know. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to all our pages on YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter. It's all Board at Work with two O's. And uh, this is Thunder Yee from Board at Work saying thank you and always enjoy entertainment.